Oh, I can't believe how beautiful Oxnard is. I know. Maybe we could get a house here one day. In our dreams. All right, let's get this going. Hey, good afternoon. Strawberry. Uh, sure. <laughs> wow. Mm, good strawberry. Well, of course. They're grown right here in Oxnard. Sometimes we even call them nardberries. <laughs> you girls today. Oh, we need to put a word in your dictionary. Yeah. And do you have an appointment? Yeah, I made one online. Cat hmm. Valentine and Samantha Pouquet? It's Pocket. My screen says Pouquet. I'm pretty sure it's Pouquet. Shouldn't I know? Yeah, you should. <laughs> All right, girls, you may see the word keepers in a moment. Please, have a stand over there. I'm nervous. Don't be. We're just going to go in there and talk to you. No! Please! Your word is rejected. But it belongs in the dictionary. Silence! Take him to the basement. The basement? No! No! Please! Please put my word in the dictionary! Wait! I didn't get my strawberry! <laughs> Who are you? Well, she's Sam Bouquet. Pocket. And you? And I'm, if you please, Cat Valentine. Is this your first time in Oxnard? Yes, sir. It is. Pretty great, right? Yeah. It's a beautiful town. So, uh, we have a word. It's a wonderful word. Then it really needs to be in your dictionary. Silence! <laughs> State your word. Ahem. <clears throat> the word we bring unto you is, um, lumpacious. You could go right between lummox and lumpfish. Your evidence? Huh? The word lumpacious is unknown to us. We must have evidence that the word exists. Okay, um... But what if we showed you proof that a famous person said the word lumpacious? A famous person? Yeah. It would have to be someone truly famous. Uh, like a movie star. Or a politician. Uh, an athlete. Yeah, yeah. So, if we got proof that one of those kind of people said lumpacious, you'd put it in your big word book thing? We would accept such evidence. Great. You gonna be here next week? Of course. Where else would we go? We're already in Oxnard. 